What was that like? I don't oh. know. I just need to apologise as well. The minute I try my wah wah, my whole coordination between playing up here and wiring down here goes completely out the window. And the phone rings and the, uh, everything just goes. Anyway, welcome back to Anderson's Hello. TV. Um, Good morning. That's Pete. I'm Lee. These uh -huh. are Schecters. Uh, but before we start talking about them, if you're enjoying what you're seeing, we put videos out. I can't even speak. That's how oh, exciting. That's how we put <laughs> videos out every day on this channel talking about guitar gear. Uh, and if you don't want to miss out on what we're doing, please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Bell? Um, probably not much to fast forward to in this video. And we do have timestamps, but we're only talking about the MV6 guitar all the way yeah. through. Um, and if you can't afford one of these, maybe you can afford a t-shirt. I'm just saying. Yeah, or Link something below. else in the website. And you can buy pics on there as well. So, you can. You right, can. these, Schecter. We all know and love Schecter. Having a real renaissance, I think, over the last 10 years or so. Um, but absolutely, you know, one of the original uh, Californian kind of mod shop yeah. guitars. Absolutely. Um, I suppose possibly better known for some of their more metal style guitars, but you know, they have heritage in doing very classic guitars. Mark Knopfler. Mark Knopfler. Exactly. So oh, MV6 series, I guess, kind of sits in that slightly more super straty, hybrid-y kind of yeah. thing. Four colors, new for 2023. Um, I, love the, I love the white there. There's something about the white with the... Is that a Padoop neck on here? I mean, yes, we're going to go to it in a I minute. I knew you were going to say that. No, Pardoop. sorry, not Padoop. I think it's, it's Rosewood. I think it's Wengi. Wenge. So, Mr. Peach, shall yes. I tell you the yes. specifications? Yes, spec me up, please. Spec me up. Spank me. Spec me any way you want me. <laughs> uh, okay, so starting from the top, mm -hmm. uh, Schecter are using their own brand locking tuners. Maple board, uh, maple neck on two models, mm -hmm. and then a um, Wengi neck ebony board. Let me get to that in a minute. I'm on the mm -hmm. wrong page for this. Um, thin C-shaped neck. Yeah, it he is mentioned quite thin. it's probably too thin for him. I didn't mind it, but... I don't, it's not, it's just getting used to it. For me, thin necks, uh, I, le I like a little bit of a girth in my hand. <laughs> you do. You uh, then we've got 25 and a half inch scale, so pretty traditional there. Oh, yeah. You can see the actual thicknesses of the neck are on the uh, website if you want to go. 24 okay. frets, extra jumbo frets, flat radius, so 14, 14 inch radius. I thought so. Um, really nice trim system. I mean, it's, yeah. it's definitely point. just a sort of a... I think it's a sort of a, a, a relatively common Far Eastern made trem system that you see on a few guitars, but it's got that really sturdy kind of two pivot point vibe pivot point. to it. Do you know what? I tell a lie, it is a Schecter one, but it... Oh, so it's own brand one? Well, That's it doesn't say Schecter on it, but it says Schecter on the, yeah. on the website. Well, I suspect it's a, you know, bought from a, the same factory. Most yes. people buy this one. Yeah. Basswood body. Bass, Bass. Do you say basswood? Basswood. Basswood. Uh, slab of the bass. You know, a slab uh, strat style body. Um, nice contours on it. Check to diamond see that, yeah. pickups, which, uh, do you know what? I'm sort of, let me just triple check. Yes, I am on the correct, I am on the correct page. It's telling <laughs> me that there's a neck pickup, uh, a bridge pickup and a middle pickup. I'm guessing they mean... Yeah, you know, well, you've I've got five-way selector switch on there, so that's where it comes to that, you know. You know why? This is me being a donut head. This absolutely is three single-coil pickups. It's just yes. that the two back ones are very close together. So it's, yes. it's kind of not a humbucker, except maybe it is. It, 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 it be, probably becomes a humbucker with the five-way switch. Yeah. Uh, shall I just? Should we just put this graphic on the screen now, showing you what the various things do? Yeah, let's do, you, do that. Or maybe let's maybe you'll go through we'll it. Demonstrate it. Okay, we'll demonstrate it. Okay, so position uno. Yeah. What else can I tell you? I like the truss rod adjustment on these guitars. But, yeah, you know what? Um, yeah, go on. Position so, uno is, uh, or position five. Which way do you start, want to go? Position five, five is the neck pickup on its own. Yeah, okay. It's got a nice uh, S-type style uh, strategy yeah. tone. Sounds great. Sounds great. Yeah. I really like Schecter pickups. These are just their yeah. Diamond series, which is the sort of the Far Eastern it's, stuff. It's, but they always they sound make nice, good man. pickups. Yeah. Um, okay, so position four is yeah. all three pickups wired in parallel. Oh, holy smoke.
Yeah. It's really nice. Um, position three is neck and middle in parallel, so like a position four on a strap. So. Would be. But they're quite far apart, aren't they? Which yep. means they'll get a little bit of a different uh, yep. spank to them. Thumb didn't want to that do is a, what it that is does. a different it's a good sound, sound to position four on a strat, isn't it? It's more What's middle about it? It's more like a middle position. It sounds I great, if man. That middle pick Plays up really good. Isn't reverse wound. I wonder if that's what it is, because it doesn't. It hasn't Maybe it's got not, that phase yeah. cancelling kind of effect that a reverse round middle pickup. That might be what this. Doesn't sound. It might be what it is. It might be what it is. Anyway, so, position two is just the middle pickup. Just this one here. Yep. You know, Rick can be found. I don't know what that was. <laughs> Quite pokey. Let's try a bit of uh, ER2 Thorpey. Fallout cloud there oh, on the top of that. Great. And then unsurprisingly, the last position are those two pickups, but in series. So humbucker style wiring. But at a slant, which is again probably gonna give it a little bit more bass end on the on the lower strings. Yes. So let me just Wow. Hang on. And whilst Pete tunes then, I will tell you that actually on the purple and the white guitar, it is a wengi or wenge, wenge. or venge, depending on uh, how you pronounce venge. your W's venge. and your G's, uh, and an ebony fretboard. Ebony fretboard, I really mm. like this guitar. Mm. I really like it. Not just I, a little not bit, just a little, little bit, bit, a lot of it. Let's just put the Dane on. Do it. Neck. And then position four. Wow. Position three. That's a good sound. And put that in two. I know. I know. The, uh, I know. I know. I tell the, you what. The Maverick uh, Top Gun thing.
I, really I feel, like, this I feel like we need to take our shirts off and play volleyball in a homoerotic way. <laughs> With a little moustache <laughs> and some aviator sunglasses on it. Right. Um, Man, I like this guitar. Do you know, Jesus okay, Christ there's not much this. else to really tell you. A bit confused as to why Schecter have decided to call this the multi-voice series, as it's a five-way switch with got, much the same voicings as any other well, five-way switch guitar would have, but there we are. Not really, though. And can I just point out, that, of course, when you look one. at it, I'm going to point it out, this looks like the California Special. You know, um, oh, right. Thorns, so we, custom yeah, we shop, see two guitars the, yeah. here. We see if you if you so these are in the UK anyway. These are just under a thousand pounds, and is there a is a left-handed one in white. Yeah, only white. Um, but that's and we kind of see a much cheaper. <laughs> we see a much <laughs> cheaper Squire Contemporary yes. uh, Strat, which yeah. had this. So if you're kind of going, that looks cool, but I, I haven't got a thousand pounds yeah. I don't know what the squire would have been three, three or four hundred something yeah. like that you could go that way or if you go I like this but I want to spend loads more yeah it was yeah Ron the Thorn, Ron Thorn did a the Fender special. Custom Shop it's slightly his, his one has got like a, a jazz master mm. types trim has it and it's slightly a bit more sort of so there's um, nothing like this then other than no 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 <laughs> but it, it does look like this but of course you know he makes them all by hand which means it takes longer but but yep. it's that's the same I really really like this guitar mm. i've seen it out there and yep. i thought i would love to try this and now i tried it i don't even mm. mind the neck can you hear how i'm sweating there <laughs> sweating sweating i mean it's it's indonesian made uh so i guess you know it's kind of sitting up there's a few guitars coming out of indonesia now that are in that sort of thousand pound it's all it's almost like over the last three years, there's been that shift, hasn't yeah, yeah. there? Sort of Indonesia guitars are now the price that Korean guitars used to be and Korean are the price that Japanese guitars used yeah. to be. And yeah, not for all, every brand, but for the big yeah. ones. Um, Car insurance yeah, have gone I'm, up 150 quid. I'm with you. I kind of, I like, I like guitars that have a sort of a, still a, a, a Fender throwback. Yeah, like a contemporary, but, like, a, like an yeah, but a, mod, like a mod shop strap. Yeah. Though. So, you know, Charvel's. Yeah. But in a way that, I don't really think that sort of ESP or Jackson do this kind no, of thing. This you know, is a it's, thing. it's very much Sheck to do it well. Um, I would Charvel do it well. Even Ibanez, if you go down the AZ, uh, AZ yes, AZ, range, AZ, kind AZ. of do it well. I mean, I guess you could say Fender probably do it well on some of their models. I think I would like to try yes. if Schecter is watching this video to do a 22 fret neck neck on it. How many slightly fatter, slightly f no, that's got. How many frets are on a Nick Johnson? Where's the orange one? Because uh, to 20, be fair, it's 22. But the you, neck, the neck needs to be slightly. Can you pull the, the Johnson out? <laughs> Excuse me. Absolutely, I'm pulling my I orange could, Johnson yeah. out. Yeah. So what's that's 22? Is it on the Nick yeah. Johnson? See, and you can see. To be honest, they they look like they're much the same body, yeah. same trim. So to be honest with you, no, and, it's it's not. No, you think because it's a different that's body, a different, different. It's a different Nick. Oh yeah. Cut here there. Okay. But I would. So you can't. But that and a slightly fatter neck. Or something yeah, like, I mean, like, an old, like, like an old strat that's been modded, you know. These are these two, the MV6 and the and the Nick Johnson are probably my personal two favourite Schecter guitars yeah. in that sort of Indonesian range. I think um, no, Nick. Sorry, but I think this one for me is only because it's purple. No, I like the white one. The white one looks amazing, but I really like mm. this. Yeah, I'd look, and I think actually the Wengi, Wengi, Wengi. Wengi. I mean the the what? maple neck has got that. Um, satin um, finish on it so mm -hmm. it's very smooth but you know very familiar sort of feeling if you play guitars like that the Wangi has a open slightly uh, yeah rougher oh it is yeah there's like no grain pores, filler on here or at least you know very little so it has a slightly different vibe I think I might be with you I think I might prefer the the uh, Schecter, if you're watching Arsene Wenger if you're watching I don't need one of those, but I would love to. Oh I would my love God. One. Pete's going to need a new house to store all the guitars he gets sent. But there you go. So oh, it's so awful, isn't it? Links are below. Um, like yeah. I say, I, I kind of spotted, I was running, I was looking for stock that had just turned up in the last three or four weeks that was completely brand new in Anderton's, and these came up, and I thought, I don't think they got much of a. I don't think He's there was a great much man. shouting about these when they came out, Oof. so why not feature them? I think we should just jam out and say thank I you very agree. much for watching and we I'm love gonna... you loads and there's lots of other videos to watch and things to buy on the Anderson website. And I'm going to um... go wing. Wing.
Yeah, I'm gonna okay, go well, wingy. I'll, I'll, I'll no, go that's all right. I can go, I'll use the white one with the, I mean, this is the classic Captain, Captain. Anderton combination of the sort of the ready tortoise shell guard with the white color. <laughs>